I got a question for you. At what age would you let your child possess a firearm? Well, according to a law in Iowa, how about the age of three? Or two? Or maybe the age of one? Well, the state's House of Representatives in Iowa passed a measure that would allow children 14 and under to possess a pistol or a revolver as long as there is parental supervision. Yeah, the bill sponsor, Representative Jake Highfield, said allowing people to learn at a young age that the respect that a gun commands is one of the most important things you can do. Mm -hmm. Opponent says that it allows for ba basically babies to be operating handguns. Right. And th what they're saying is the law already allows for 14 under to use a rifle right. or a shotgun, so they're just allowing oh, yeah. pistols now. Of course, because you know what? All kids should use uh, pistols and take their Flintstone tubal vitamins right. and do all kinds of things. It's just getting nuts. Why would you give a one-year-old a pistol? I have a two-and-a-half-year-old. What, 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 what is that? What, they don't need a gun. You have to be 18 to vote. You have to be 21 to drink. Why does a four-year-old need a handgun? It's a kid with a... Yeah. But the thing is, I can teach you I'm saying a kid with a terrible twos and a handgun. No, oh my no. gosh! Imagine that if is I, like a nightmare. If she's trained here or something, they say like she's trained to have it. I can't. I would never put my four-year-old in that possession of having that responsibility of something in her hand that could kill someone. Right. So why would I but, do but that? But then, Lance, when you were growing up, you were allowed to use a shotgun, right? Or I mean, I had my first shotgun at seven, eight years right. old, Jeez. and uh, and 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 I understand where they're coming from because uh, I learned safety behind yes. my guns, and I remember my dad like really <laughs> respecting what I had in my. And so I'm I'm so afraid of guns because of how I was taught. So it really is all on the parents. And, right. and a responsible parent will teach their kid the right way of doing it. You know, as long as these parents are licensed, like I said, I think we should have way more stricter rules on owning a gun. There should be a license like driving a car. But yeah, but, but even with that, Lance, I, I kind of get it with a rifle or a shotgun because that's hunting. What a could pistol. you possibly need a pistol for? I, well, I that's don't, the thing that I, I don't understand. No, I, I don't know. I, the whole thing scares me. Yeah. Yeah. But and, Lance hit on something, I, though. He just said, though, it's about... No, but you were right. You said you can educate someone, your father educated you about sex, without, without giving them, them a the gun. gun. Right. I yeah, can yeah. tell you all about a gun without saying, now you can carry it. Right. 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 I can't. I can't. I think nothing about guns. And the thing is, I was never allowed to have that gun by myself at all. It was always with my dad. Take one accident, one That's moment. The thing. Accidents will happen. Yeah, exactly. Like, they're gonna give a kid a gun. It better shoot jelly or water or. <laughs> That's it. Or <laughs> jello or. <laughs> or All right, candy. I think we agree on this one. All right. I don't know. We all go through ups and downs with family members. You know, sometimes you're fighting with them, whatever. Sir Elton John is no exception, apparently. He told Rolling Stone magazine that though he's been estranged from his mom for seven years, he doesn't miss her. She just turned 90, and he sent her flowers for her birthday, and he says that he is happy to financially support her, but he has no interest in reconciling with her because of very harsh comments that she has made in the past about his husband, David. And she's made those comments in the press, and he just said, that's it. So, you know, we were talking about this, you know, in the dressing room before, how hard it must be to break with a parent, because that, that, that's a big deal. Mm -hmm. You know, who do you side with, though, if the it's parent hard. has been Well, so she said this stuff. in the press, too. Right. She said this in the press, and she called him an right. in the press. Right. Her, her David, husband. right. Husband. So, I mean, you know, you, 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 you have to realize your son's in the public eye. He's very famous. You can't put that out there. So for him to be angry with her, I understand they it. They get but a pass because of age, maybe? Just like senility? Or so maybe sad. she's not... Well, no, but maybe she's, she's not... A, but no, but maybe she's just not all right there and she just blurts out what she says. I mean, well, I, think, I think you side with the uh, the husband or the spouse or the wife. I mean, this is your team. This is who you're married to. But it's probably very hard to move forward. If something happens to her and she dies, you don't reconcile or but make I amends that, with oh, something. Go ahead. I, I, I think that for me, like for my mother, mm -hmm. I have so much respect for my mother. And I think it's very important to have respect for your family. So while I do appreciate that there's relationship there, I don't think you should, uh, you know, let go of your mother because your mother's the reason why you're here, you know? Well, so it's but, kind of like, I know it's but, difficult what kind to of say. Mother was she, though? I, I mean, you know, he I, talks about when he was a kid and his father, I think, beat him or treated him pretty badly. And the mother said, Look, you know, that's just the way things are done. Sort of blamed it on Elton John. So maybe she wasn't the best mother. Yeah. The weird thing was she had her birthday party and they had an Elton John impersonator come. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Birthday party? Yes. Yeah. Oh, wow. She's 90? I'm She's surprised 90. she didn't drop dead. I can't believe it. <laughs> That's the only part that's a little creepy.